Franchise Report. Reporting live. Oh. As it goes down another mother effing day, the franchise support is in effect. Franchise in this building, the lovely little TCA in the building, and here for the first time to bless us with his presence, Joe Grits, what up? Yeah, 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 yeah. Hoo, 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 la. First of all, <laughs> first of all, that's a fire ass name. Appreciate it. How did he come up with yeah, Joe Grits? Yeah, how'd you get up? Uh, how'd you come up with Joe Grits? Long story short, because it is, a, is a, it is a story, but basically it was a. Uh, I, I do love Grits the fool. But I actually, I actually, yeah, I do. It, it started, you know, it, it became a joke. It, it became a joke. You know what I'm saying? Like, I actually got burnt by it. You know what I'm saying? Somebody really? threw it on me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But it was like a joke in the hood, like when I was in middle school. And then when it came to me wanting to rap and stuff, my brother, we was trying to juggle a few names. And it was Joe Gums at first because I had braces. Nah. And I ain't cleaned the braces. And you know how your gums inflame? This nigga. So, yeah, so it was Joe Gums. And then. My nah. brother, just, we, he just said Joe Grits, and we just, we just I just I, went I, with it. I, I, I couldn't yeah, it then it went to the streets and everything. Get rich in the streets, you know. Once I got into the streets, so it's like, yeah, Joe Grits is what it is. So where you from? Um, I'm originally from South North Connecticut, and I migrated to Wait, Bridgeport, Connecticut. What is South North Connecticut. So, uh, Fairfield County. You know what I'm saying? You got the rich towns like Greenwich. Or, okay. or or even like Stanford where the WWE okay, wrestling okay, at. Norwalk is another town, yeah. and then Bridgeport is the biggest city, which I migrated like middle school. Okay. So like I, I represent both cities and towns because like I you know my name relevant both places, so I don't never forget either one. Okay. I rode Dolo from state to state. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> how, long, how long you been rapping? Oh, I've been rapping uh, since like eight or nine years old. I, my first project was on a cassette tape, so y'all know I've been doing it for a minute. Mm, mm, yeah. Mm. And I ain't even old, but I've been doing it for a minute. <laughs> well, 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 let, let, let me define old. Let me define old. Was, it, there, <laughs> was it a blank cassette tape or did you t- record over a tape? Nah, I recorded over. I put the tissue in it. Me and my brother used to do it. And oh, we, yeah, and, he's old. He's old. He's old. You old. You old. You old. You old. You old. No studio. Yeah, just rapping in the speaker. Yeah, fam. Yeah, yeah. You know, but you know, yeah, you a little classic. You a little throwback. So let me ask you, since you throw back just like me. Um, how do you like today's hip hop game? The hip hop game right now? Yes. Um, wait, 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 stop, stop. Let me first of all, I didn't just say what, what do you rap about? What do you rap about? Now first? I rap about um the politics and streets. Cause I'm I'm a, I'm also an activist and a and a politician. Okay. You know what I'm saying? So I had to definitely like alter my, my music a little bit, but I still talk about twenty to ten years ago when I was running the streets. So I mix it. In what way? Um, I ran for city council and Word. and I'm a part of the the Democratic Town Committee. Yeah, really, family. So you could, you could Google dope. me, all that's gonna okay. pop up. That's and, dope, and family. That's dope. Activism. I, I started the highway uh, takeover out there in Connecticut. First one to do it, and it went all over. You know, it went viral after that. And um, I done been on uh, the Atlanta Highway with Killer Mike and Ti. So, and this is all documented if y'all go to my uh, social media. Okay, 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 okay. So, so now, how do you like today's hip hop game? Um. You know, between the New England, I love it. I feel like we all rising. <laughs> but 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 industry wise, <laughs> if you say industry wise, I nah, I don't really, I don't really like it industry wise. Cause I, if if you ask me what I'm listening to, is either artists that done passed away or they dropped like 10, 20 years ago. Like, let me ask you, do you think that's a problem with us mm. at our age? The fact that we won't take the chance to listen to new music and we just stop that. Mm. My favorite artist that mm. passed away. Like a lot of my, a lot of my DJ friends and stuff like that. Stop following music after 2010. Mm. And, and can't figure out why they can't be booked no more. Well, family, you know, you ain't never follow anything for the best. I mean, here and there, I'm rocking. Like, I, you know, I still throw the Meek Mills on. My son's 16, you know what I'm saying? So I hear the little babies, but I, t- t- they don't, they not dropping albums. I'm an album dude. Like, when you let, they they, they, my, 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 I'm a songwriter, they like, you know what I'm saying? That's why Salute Day Heat, because, like, that freestyling, like, he he, he killed it. That, that was like, three EPs. Yeah. That was yeah. three EPs. <laughs> my, I, my approach is, like, I, you know, I put, Songs and and that's just what I do. Like you know what I'm saying. Like I, I like it, everything is structured. Like I just flipping rhyming rhyming. That that's not my thing. So, so. the bars okay. and, and and what they're talking about doesn't bother you. It's just like the the, the quick one minute and forty five second songs. Just it's not it's not for you. For, for yeah. me to listen to, yeah, nah, it don't bother me because I come from that life. So what Dirk is talking about, I done been through that. I done been shot. I done got cases and and all that. You know what I'm saying. Mm-hmm. So now nah, it, it's just. I just feel like they not putting together, they not putting Illmatics, they not putting together, together reasonable doubts in, in albums mm-hmm. like that. Mm-hmm. Twenty years from now, we'll remember the song, but you're not gonna say I can't tell you a Dirk album if you ask me. You tell me five hot songs, I'll tell you five hot songs. So that you know that that and there's no disrespect to him. You know what I'm saying? That's my Muslim brother. Like I just you know. 
That is just that's what the the, the current state of hip hop is. It's just quick, you know, Drake joint, Drake hits popping out, but the albums. I still don't hear no albums. Yeah. Mm. I, I get it. You're mm. right. You're, you're right. right. No, you're definitely you're right. right. You're, the way you put it is, you're right. Who would, go ahead. Go ahead. So, did you, do 